Which one are you starting first? We are doing the sunflower burger, oh, sunflower. which is also the same material that you use to okay. make it balls. Sunflower. Yeah. Four cups sunflower seeds. Okay, so oh, today we are making the sunflower burger. We can make it into meatballs as well. Okay, so here is the recipe. So this one is four cups of uh, grounded uh, sunflower seeds. Okay, you have to blend it and make it fine. Uh, uh, and then this is two cups of walnut. Oh, they're so miserable, uh, they become too little bit. <laughs> this is high omega 3 good fats. Okay. Um, yeah. So while uh, actually I like to also mix them, you know, as we put them in, a uh, so easier because later when uh, you have a bout, then it's more difficult to stir and Do make. Do we need it. to roast it before we grind it? No need. It's just it's raw. raw. That's right, raw. Okay. So you have the three quarter cup wholemeal flour. Okay. So wholemeal flour is three quarter cup. One. This is atta flour. This is atta flour. Well, this is mainly more for binding the, the ball. I saw atta flour, but I don't know what is it for. It's wholemeal flour. It's wholemeal, flour. Oh. It's wholemeal they grain, but this one is finely ground wholemeal flour. Usually they use it for chapati. Yeah, yeah. If you yeah. make okay. it into bread, you'll need glucose. So there is this. Um, this one is breadcrumbs. I actually use my sourdough bread. I just <laughs> made that. Oh, I thought you add that later. No, uh, no I, I'm going to put one cup only. Oh, the It's supposed to be one and a half cup, right. but I'm just going to put one cup only. Sorry, because I've done this recipe before, I know that I'm not going to put more than that. Okay. So, But anyway, it all depends on your ingredients. Because some of the ingredients are a bit too liquid or whatever especially your tofu mm -hmm. you know and uh, yeah and depend on how you grate your potato and all this thing uh. yeah okay one and a half cup mashed tofu mashed tofu one half cup I use tau kwa today and uh, garlic four cups obviously this is more than four la. I guess I like I like more garlic. This so, is medicine. Yeah, since this is good for you, then put a bit more. Nah, huh? It doesn't matter, it's just a taste only. Okay, what else? Onion. Onion, one big onion. Mm. Uh, one. Mine, this one, are you sure? One large one. This one. one large one. Hey, have you seen a really large one? Oh. Yeah, but I put a bit more. Nah, huh? Okay, the trick nah, to get a, a more um, moist, moist burger. Okay. Ah, Patty uh, is to add all, a lot of raw things inside. It will hold the liquid and then it will not dry up the whole thing. So I find that these are the things that I can, is uh, really um, something that you can actually put a bit more. Uh, huh? But things like liquid, uh, uh, the, the dry things, all this you cannot. You have to be a bit more cautious with that. Okay. Two tablespoons of powder. Okay. This tablespoon. I use chicken star. Like you can use anything. It's but not real chicken. It's not real chicken. It's seasoning. Right? It's seasoning. Yeah. seasoning. Yeah. Sorry, mm -hmm. too fat. Can go in. Chicken like chicken, chicken, okay. chicken seasoning. This one bought from Loma Linda. My sister buy for me one. Okay, so it's two tablespoon. Okay, okay this one. Uh, um... That's why I say salt must leave to the last because we do not know how saltish this is. This is half tea tablespoon, that's why she's doing. Yeah, I'm doing four times because this is half a day. My big one can go in. It's not, it's not in the same order because it's, I, listed. it's all listed. It's all okay. listed. Okay. Then, stock that's stock powder. Huh? Okay. So, onion and garlic powder. Huh? Mm -hmm. Two teaspoons each. Huh? Okay. There, there is no mention of other. Garlic mm. and onion powder. Huh? There's yeah. no mention of garlic and hey, onion powder. How come? Yeah, there's no mention. Sorry, but there is. No mention. Neither in the original nor in the one you sent. 
Uh, okay, but there is. Sorry, ah, maybe a uh, typo okay. error. No, but there is. How much? It's uh, two teaspoon each. Two teaspoon each. This is a teaspoon. Yeah, yeah. Wow, I'm getting old already. Cannot see. Yeah. This one is garlic powder, mm. and this is onion powder. Oh, I know, I know. I think I probably messed up, but never mind. Even if it. It won't die on it, just give you more flavor. <laughs> yeah. I think I, I may have mixed up my two recipes. Huh? Sorry about this. <laughs> That's why you don't find it inside. But anyway, it's still okay. Also, no need to add then. Uh, yeah. Because I was doing two recipes at one time. Huh? So you so, got your potato and carrots? Yeah, so I got a bit a bit mixed up maybe. Yeah, okay. Um. Let me just stir it up first. Mm. Now it's easier to stir without a lot of things inside. But actually, uh, I'm going to put everything in and then... Okay, tomato paste is 4, four tablespoons. Tablespoon. And... is all in so this one is grated, grated potato. potato i'm oh, sorry yeah 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 just turn um, black <laughs> I, I, I i just did i didn't even dare yeah, to <laughs> do it in advance you know i just did it just now only and it is it looks horrible salt water okay now I'm going to do something. And then um, you got the salt. Huh? Salt to taste. Uh, wait, must your... must mix first. And taste. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> you must mix then. Because, um, first of all, I do not know how salty the stock is. Wow, some of the stock uh, are super salty, you know. Then you no need to put salt uh, already. Uh, the thing is so... Okay, today the thing looks a bit dry mm -hmm. because, uh, I don't know, <laughs> I think maybe because my potato, the grater, uh, this one grated already, like, mm -hmm. it's a bit, a bit more, um, what do you call it, more thick, uh. but it's the same grater, I also don't know why. Okay, okay, mm -hmm. the original recipe calls for, um, calls for water. Mm -hmm. Which I didn't dare to put inside because yeah, it will be watery. It will be watery, and then you have a ball that is so soggy that is not nice, mm -hmm. So, so what I do is that you hand mix is easier. Mm -hmm. You see, now is uh, mm -hmm. there's no need to put any more water yeah. already. Mm -hmm. So you see, I I completely took out the water from the, that one. Mm -hmm. But they say to squeeze the the what do you call it, the potato of all the liquid. I feel so wasted. Right? <laughs> so, and I like the potato to retain its moisture, mm. to do its work. So that this thing first is not soggy, and then when you eat it, nah, there's still moisture inside. Okay. Okay, so this is your ball, your patty. Actually, uh, I normally make one batch before the cooking lesson. Nah. But uh, since it's today is less people, right? I didn't do one. Okay, so we will have to bake it while you are studying, your having your health lectures. Okay, so basically that's all you do. It's very simple, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's easy to make. And I like this recipe because first it's healthy. You get to eat a lot of uh, sunflower seed and uh, walnut, you get all your oil, your omega and all this oil yeah? mm -hmm. and a lot of um, like uh, other uh, minerals as well especially from the sunflower seed eh? mm -hmm. we are supposed to eat sunflower seed every day isn't it? or every alternate day every alternate day okay, so this is about it okay, so what we do is taste it now 
all this ingredient you can actually just eat it. Hmm. Okay, I think a teaspoon of salt will be enough. Really. But when it bakes, doesn't it dry more and then the seasoning is stronger? Hmm? The After it's baked, uh -huh. it is drier, right? Uh, Will the seasoning be stronger as a result? Uh, yes, but right now it's not, 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 not salty. Okay. Uh. Oh. Because, um, yeah, what I did is only to put the, the one, I actually totally omitted the salt. Okay, then Diana, can you give me one teaspoon of salt? Um, this is a teaspoon. So okay. I I take inside the is. Okay. Is this a teaspoon? Yeah, that's a teaspoon. So more more than. Okay, give me, give me, give oh. me. Okay, so I think that should be enough, baby. So usually. The sunflower seed and the walnut seed, you ground it, you use what blender? Ah, uh, yes, I use my blender. You can dry, uh, dry blender. Yeah, you have to dry blender. Okay, now when it comes to seed and everything, uh, you always dry blend it. Whether, sometimes the whole recipe tell you, you put everything inside, uh, then blend it all together. Then once you put in water, you don't get the same kind of fineness that, that uh, you should get uh, if, you, if you grind it. If you grind it um, dry, so you have, have to use those machines for nuts to grind it, right? Not necessary. I use my blender, the one behind you. Oh, uh, the one is super good. Uh. Blender will grind nuts also? Yeah. Um, I thought you, you need to put water or a blender no, no, usually. No, no. It, it, okay. it probably this is a different part. Oh. This one is a high power. Oh. So I use this actually to grind my grains as well, like oh. uh, oats or uh, this thing to make it into flour. Yeah. 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 You like you like you like you will like, like. You will like it. <laughs> it's one you like. Yeah. You like. You? Oh, okay. okay, so this is the ball ball. This is you like, is it? Yes. Mm. Oh. Okay, my you is very sticky. Yeah. So it's easy to form? It's very easy to form. Okay. So no you... Tree. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. What flower did we put on this now? Atta flour. Atta, atta. So the atta flour is the one that combines. Yeah. It's a binding agent. Yeah. This one, NTUC has it. Really? Yeah. Uh, I always see it, when I see this kind, I'll say, Ayah, this is for chapati, I will never I use it. Yeah, yeah. Then now I know. Okay. Yeah, I got one time my friend said, you want atta flour? I said, I don't know how to use it. I don't need to give it. I can use it to use make bread. bread like. huh? You can use it in many things. Oh, I use it to make bread. Cakes, waffles. Oh, make bread. Ah. Mm. Yes. Oh. How to make it easy for us? Okay, so you use a clean rag, you put into uh, whatever, uh, huh? actually, um, yeah, and then um, Okay, so what you do is, now you want to make the ball, right? So to make almost standard, you see how big you want it. Lah. But, well, maybe this is a bit too big. Lah. Okay, so you get a measurement of about the size that you want. Then this is very good as in that. You know, you get to like push it up easily. It doesn't get stuck all over. Mm. Okay, and like that it won't roll. Okay. So this is what you do with all your ball. Okay. Is it easy or not? Hmm. Huh? Yes. Very easy, yeah. Huh? Good, good. good. Ah, if okay. Sandwiches. Now, if you want to make for sandwiches, huh? Yeah. Um. Recently, I did one, and then what I do is that I know my rack is about this size, right? My wrap is about this size, so I make the, the patty just from one end to the other end about that length, you know, 
So it definitely need more lah. So my patties are all long long like that, you know. Okay. So that when I do the sandwich, yeah. you know, I just put in the middle. I put the vegetable on top with all my dressing, everything. Fold it, fold it, and that's it. You know. So any shape you want, okay. Okay. Enough already. So that's how they make the ball lah.